All right, folks, um, this is uh, how not to repair a cable. As you can see, the tech was over in the winter to fix something, and he wrapped electrical tape around this, which obviously is already starting to come apart, as you can see. Uh, didn't even caulk that hole, which is kind of weird. And, I don't know, as you can see, these screws aren't even tightened down. Hey, there's that, so you could probably even pop this open. Let's see what he, whoop, yeah, there you go. What is that? A uh, gizmo of some kind. And there's another gizmo. This looks like some, oh yeah, hey, that goes over there, I bet. <laughs> Jesus. Uh, that's not screwed down. All right, well, I'm gonna, <laughs> this is funny. I'm gonna check this out and clean it up and fix it up and I guess I'll uh, do a little picture at the end of this. <laughs> uh, following uh, what's here already, you can see one of the, the gizmos that fell out uh, probably snaps in here for uh, another line, I'm, I'm guessing. So that just, I'm sure that just clips in and, and the wire goes into there and obviously I only have one line left at the house and with a half decent internet connection now I can probably go VoIP and be done with it all. But uh, nevertheless, these just click in there, so I'm going to, I guess I'll click them in anyways, because you never know in the future, right, even if I sell the house, somebody might want that, and I'll, uh, I'll fix that up. Well, that took all of two minutes, <laughs> so um, just click them in, they just pop in like Lego, right, and the hardest part was just uh, snaking this wire through the little groove on the top, but uh, it's it's all in there, so that that took no time at all. I don't know why that guy couldn't have done that on that day. He just tossed them all in there. All right, so all I had were some of these butt connectors in my toolbox, so I crimped them, which is better than before because the wires were just kind of twisted. I wish I would have taken a picture of that earlier, so that should be better. And I got a little heat shrink tubing here that I'm going to slide over there and clean up. So. So far, it's probably taken me a good 10 minutes or so to kind of fix this up. And I'll show you what it looks like when I'm done. And there you go. Uh, probably, I don't know, 15 minutes, maybe 20. I put a little, a little clamp there, just kind of hold it all up. And um, I used self-fusing tape for this part here because it was just kind of big and awkward. And I didn't have shrink shrink tubing for that type of, um, that thick, that big enough connection. So that's it. It's all done. That's it.